Beep beep, everyone. Battle of the Hangar Boxes. 2020 Tops Update and 2021 Tops Update. Uh, I'm hoping this is an evil, or not an evil, an even playing field for these two. They both have the same number of cards. I'm sure the odds of things are a little bit different between the two. Um, before we begin, let's have Purple Plastic Toilet make an appearance. And I guess I'm supposed to come up with a word of the day. Uh, let's, uh, let's pick Steamroller. And I offer you this sentence, which I did not prepare, so it's just coming off the top of my head. Ah... Uh, Due to the gravity of Uranus, no steamrollers have reached escape velocity. If you have a sentence for the word steamroller that you would like to contribute, please post it in the comments. Let's see, uh, I guess we'll start with the older pack, 2020, and then we'll do 2021 after that. And... Um, I don't, um, well, this box is different than, than what I'm used to opening. Okay, look for autograph and relic cards. Is there anything special about this? No. Well, if you want to look at the uh, odds, there they are. Okay, gold is one in four. Let's see. I'm used to being open by the side. That's what the more newer ones have. So I, uh, I did not buy these out in the wild. I'm pretty sure I got them off of eBay, and I should have opened that from the bottom. <laughs> okay, jeez. I know you're all out there going, "What a bonehead." <laughs> What a bonehead, yeah. Well, this is my first time opening up 2020 update. Um, if you've seen any of my other videos, I, I took a long hiatus from the hobby and hadn't collected anything between the early 90s and last fall when I decided to start collecting again. So I see there's a different color in the middle there, so there must be something interesting there. Now, I guess most uh, people judge their um, their um, how they uh, judge which one of these wins based on, um, I guess, the hits. Uh, we'll use hits, but we'll also determine it by the number of star player cards and uh, important rookies. And, you know, I'm not real familiar with all the modern players. So I don't know what is best. So my judgment will probably be different from yours. So there's Chris Davinsky. I don't know who that is. Aristides Aquino rookie card. Mm, I don't know who that is. So we're not going to find too much, I guess. Terrence Gore. Okay, David Ortiz. We do know who that is. So we'll start the pile with him. Jed Giorco. Felix Hernandez. All-Star game card. Uh, I guess we'll put him over here. Tyler Wade. That is a curious pose. I, I think this qualifies as a burping card. So we're going to put him in a special pile over here. Yet, oh boy. Yenis Cespedes. Home Run Derby. I guess we'll put him in this pile. Christian Arroyo. Chris Sale. Jump number six, National Celebrate 6-5 walk-off win. 
Jason Kipnis. Yeah, a lot of these names I'm not familiar with. Remember, I wasn't following baseball the year these came out. Justin Verlander I'm familiar with. Bryce Harper I'm familiar with. And Kenley Jansen I'm familiar with, who I think might be close to 400 saves if he hasn't already passed it. I don't know. Zach Green... Remember to take anything I say in my videos with a grain of salt because I'm just flying off the top of my head. Anthony Alford, that's a nice photo. That might qualify as all parts in the air. So I think I'll put him over here. Hunter Pence. Yeah, let's check out Hunter Pence. Okay, he had a pretty decent career. I guess I'll put him in this pile. Giovanni Gal Galagos. Boy, that, that one I'm not sure about the pronunciation. Let's flip around. Richie Martin. Philip Deal. Scott Barlow. Mark McGuire. 1992 home run derby. Okay. Zach Granke. Active leaders. I like looking at active leaders cards. That's strikeouts. Kyle Farmer. Jarrell Cotton. I hope I pronounced that right. Brock Holt and Bartolo Colon, <laughs> free agent, active leaders. Okay, there's Domingo Santana and uh, this is, uh, I don't know what kind of a card this is, a rainbow foil, I'll presume, Yoshi Hirano. It's not numbered. So we'll put this as a, as a hit for this. Next group, 1960s, the decade's best award winners, Willie Mays. That's a decent card. Here's 1985 design, Mike Schmidt. 35th anniversary, that looks pretty cool. It's a Hall of Famer. There's Ozzy Albies on what I presume is a turkey red card. Okay. And Ken Griffey Jr. Dale Murphy. Brooks Robinson. Nick Madrigal, number one prospect on the 89 design. Oh, no. Mick, Nick, you fell down. Jeez. No damage, so we're okay. Gotta be careful, bud. Um, I guess we'll put him over here. Nico Horner, rookie debut. I guess we'll put him in that pile, too. Jerry Rodriguez. Dario Ag Agrizal. That's kind of a neat name. Michael Hermosillo. Nick Turley, Cheslor Cuthbert. We, we should just have a pile of interesting names. Gabe Spire, and base that on who wins the battle. Alex Verdugo. What's the deal with Alex Verdugo? Okay. Jonathan Davis. That's a pretty cool photo. <laughs> and Yasmani Tomas and the last group Anthony Rendon Franchi Cordero Edwin Encarnacion Wade LeBlanc Joe Panic, Kyle Ryan Josh Taylor 
Robert Stevenson, Sean Poppin, Michael Fulmer, Kyle Crick, Albert Pujols, Steve Sishek, I think that's how that's pronounced, Frank Schwindel, Brian Johnson, Eric, I'm going to say Thames, but I don't know. You know, the River Thames over in England. That could be Thames. Eric, if you're out there, please leave a comment. Nice beard, by the way. Mitch Moreland, Rowdy Telez, Chris Martin, and last card is Hunter Renfro. Whoops, desk quake, sorry. Alrighty. We'll move these off to the side. This is the pile that 2021 has to beat. We don't really have much in the way of a hit. I, I don't even know if I'd consider a rainbow foil just as a hit. And there are a burping and everything off the ground. So we'll consider that part of the equation. Let's get into 2021 and see how it does. Now I'd say so far the 2020 one had a, a lot more uh, what I would call Hall of Famer cards than I expected. All right, uh, it doesn't look like there's anything special other than you looking for stuff. 67 cards. Here's our odds for these. I'm going to have a more difficult time reading these because they're on this bizarre slant and the text is not as obvious. All right, there's our pile from this. And like the 2020 update, it's got all the neat stuff, I guess, in the middle. As you can see, there's a line of gray. It's almost like the uh, that line you find during the end of the Cretaceous period when the dinosaurs, uh, well, got obliterated. There's this line in the, in the rock layers. And here we have... Uh, an asteroid impact in the middle of this card layer. So I haven't opened up any 2021 update. I mean, I, I am sort of familiar with it. Oh, we'll take that much. These are harder to read. I just do not like the design here. So Joey Bart, rookie debut. I guess we'll put that in as a, a worthwhile card for the pile. Chris Owings. Ali Sanchez, Joey Gerber, Kirk Casale. You have to forgive me for if I mispronounce anyone. Wilson Ramos. It's all kinds of little, little dust specks in that photo. Well, I might want to put that one aside as something weird. Maybe I've started a new category. Weird, lots of orbs in the air or something. John Lester. Carlos Rodon. Twirls a no-no. I guess we'll put that in that pile. I'll flip them around. Mitch Moreland. Jose Urena. Martin Perez. And we got to flip them around again. Cody Poteet. <laughs> That's a neat name. Yeah, P-O-T-E-E-T. -E -E Ahmed Rosario. Keegan Thompson, rookie card. Gregory Santos, rookie card. Uh, Lance Lynn. Again, we have to flip him around. Brent Honeywell Jr., rookie card. Romy Garcia, rookie card. Steve Sishek, or I 
think that's how that's pronounced. Again, we have to flip them around. Chris Rodriguez rookie card. Tyler uh, Naquin. And uh, we've got our first UFO sighting. So that goes over here. Corey Ray. Yu Chang. He looks real thrilled with his hit. And again, we have to turn them over. That's getting annoying. <laughs> Bailey Ober. Mike Miner. Daniel Vogelbach. Rookie debut of Ha Seung Kim. I think we'll put that one in that pile. Luis Patino. That's a rookie card. All right. Uh, Nick Gordon, rookie, is, I guess, a rainbow foil. So I guess we'll put that there. This one's upside down. It's Garrett Cole. And it's a Topps Chrome rainbow foil, I guess. I'm not sure what that is. It, I guess that's that will give us two hits. <clears throat> and that's an older design, 92 Tops, I believe. JT Rio Muto. There's Yadier Molina. Topps Black Gold. That's an older design. <coughs> Pardon me while I clear my throat again. It's got a little bit of a speckle effect on it too. So that's our third hit. Nick Castellanos on the 86 design. That's nice. Here's Luis Garcia rookie card on the 92 design. <clears throat> Mookie Betts, that's a good one. Casey Mize rookie card. <clears throat> Pardon me, my goodness. Probably should get a drink before I start yammering away on stuff. I don't know much about Casey Mize. I guess I'll just put him there for now. Jacob deGrom. J.A. Happ. Will Vest rookie card. I mean, there's a lot of rookies in here, but I don't know who any of the, who any of them are. Josh Van Josh Van Meter, Andrew Benintendi, Kohei Arihara rookie card, Nick Nelson rookie card, Blake Snell, Victor Gonzalez, Alex Reyes, who spotted a UFO, so we got a, our second UFO card. Bryce Wilson. And here's the last of this. Wow, that's a neat card. Adolis Garcia with a spray of dirt in the air. Yeah, I think I'm going to have a start pulling cards out that have like dirt just flying everywhere. We'll call it um, the dirt collection, I guess. Emilio Pagan. Colby Allard, Chad Pinder, oops, pardon the desk quake, Seth Romero, Garrett Richards, Peter Solomon, Jordan Romano, I don't know who any of these players are, Logan Gilbert, this wasn't that long ago. Magnuris Sierra. That is a cool name. Minnesota Mashers. Twins tag team. That's Miguel Sano and Byron Buxton. I guess we'll put that in that pile. Garrett Hampson. There's another one with uh, snow all over the card. Slugger smashing snow. Miguel Cabrera and Jamer Candelario. Hmm. I'm going to put that in my special pile and start another collection of cards with snow on it. Willie Adamas. 
<laughs> of course, that's the, the only one I've ever seen so far. Alex Karoloff, rookie debut. I guess we'll put him in this pile. Billy Hamilton, who looks very happy to be on the field. Brock Holt. Taewon Walker. Chris Gittens, rookie card. And Matt Moore's last card. So, who's the winner? Let's separate those. So this is what I got out of 2021 compared to 2020 of star cards. It's rather significantly slanted towards 2020. However, there were more weird cards in 2021. You know, soup stains. Dirt flying around, that kind of you, you, There were more UFO cards. Uh, rainbow foil hits. Three times the number in 2021. Uh, so this one's a little tough. Hmm. Yeah, I almost want to give it like a toss up. I guess I'm going to have to go with the more interesting pack was the 2021. So 2021 update is our winner. I mean, I know there were more star cards in here, but there were more interesting looking photos in this one, more rainbow foils. So I'm going to have that override this. I know the Hall of Famers in here were generally turkey red. Uh, mm, you know, whatever. So the winner is 2021 update. That is our battle of the hanger boxes. Thanks a lot for watching. I hope you all have a great day from Nathan, the gnome. Boop. Uh, we bid you farewell. Beep, beep everyone.